Hey guys, Fadi is letting you know since that we have some more leaked pictures of the HTC Pyramid and this time we're going to see two new things. First, we're going to see some pictures of the inside of the phone uh, without any cover on the back and also we're going to see that the phone or the phone turned on so it seems like uh, from the source XDA developers they have posted some pictures uh, through slash gear so let's see here okay so first of all the specs it seems to be kind of the same but now it seems like we have some confirmed specs as well so first we have this QHD screen we have a 4.3 inch screen and the RAM 768 megabyte. It's a dual core 1.2 gigahertz. We have a front 8 megapixel camera and then also a VGA uh, camera on the front for you know video conferences and you know shedding and stuff like that. Also, we have now confirmed that this HTC Pyramid phone is going to run Android Gingerbread 2.3.2 and then it's also going to use HTC Sense 3.0. So let's see here, okay, first of all, we have a picture of the screen, maybe not that interesting, maybe not, maybe, no. Nah. And then we have the back as well, uh, you can see the text with HTC Sense, and then we have some, wow, it looks kind of thin, I like that, you know, the sign is like rounded edges, yeah. And then here we can see some pretty cool pictures. Uh, it's yeah, it's the it's the inside of the phone. So if you see something pretty cool here, you know, let me know. Let me see if you see some cool animals. No, I'm not sure, but yeah. And then we have this bad boy turned on, and here we can see, you know, basically it's confirmed. Yeah, front camera VGA, 8 megapixel, 4.3, 768, 4.2. Awesome, love the specs. And yeah, here we got like the home screen, looks uh, like it's using the HTC Sense 3.0. And yeah, that's a cool thing that happens when you take a picture. Random. And then we have the last one here, baseband, HTC Sense. We can see the Android version and we can see some build numbers, software numbers and browser versions and kernel versions and baseband versions and a lot of versions. So, but that's sweet. So hopefully we're going to see some more details when this phone is going to be launched officially. No idea when it's going to come out or the price, but I'm going to let you know. See you.